Welcome Irish fans to the Notre Dame men's basketball team's first official ACC basketball practice. New NCAA rules are allowing the Irish to begin their practice sessions earlier this year, just about a month before their first exhibition game here at Purcell Pavilion against Indianapolis. Today, two emphasis I really want us to think about. Let's really be conscious of communicating. Uh, also today, when we talk defensively and build some stuff, we're going to talk about 21. For the young guys, 21 is half-court pickup, and we are contesting passing lanes. We're going to be up pressuring the ball and contesting passing lanes, and we're going to be confident contesters because we know we don't have a voice and help behind us if a guy goes back door. Okay, here we go. So, two, three. Yeah. Yeah. This is our first opportunity to show you Notre Dame's talented freshman class and Notre Dame practice gear meshing in with the talented returning class from last year's NCAA tournament team. We also were able to run into some rather notable basketball names who showed up at Notre Dame's first practice. So here now is a look at the first ACC practice for Mike Bray's Fighting Irish squad and some conversations with guys we bet you'll recognize. Then it's live one-on-one. -on -one. Don't get beat. Try and keep it out of the middle. Let's watch this group here. Here we go. Good, good. Got him under control. We know where you are in the court. Know where you are. You've been around a lot this summer around this basketball team. What do you think? Oh, man, I'm excited. I'm excited to watch them. Don't tell my son. I'm supposed to be football cheering right now, but uh, I still got a little basketball in my blood. What do you see from this team, and what do you see with all the great coaches that you've worked with over the years? What do you see from Coach Bray? Well, he's obviously a great teacher. I mean, I see these guys really learning, and, um, you know, he's, he's getting them to understand kind of concepts, context of what they need to do out here. And, I mean, that's, that's half the game right there. If you can get your defense out there moving as one, understanding what you're trying to get accomplished. I mean, obviously, they've had some success over the past, but they, they know they've got to get to this next level. Uh, looks like they've got some great talent in here. I love the new point guard. They, they've got some great, um, great young guys in here. So I think they're just going to keep getting better. What are you seeing out there, this first official ACC practice for your former team? I see a lot of big, skilled guys who could shoot, and I was wishing I was 15 years younger than I am right now because it would be great to play with some of these guys. I, you know, I think the, the most exciting thing is you, you have a really interesting combination with a guy like Demetrius Jackson out here who I think has a chance to be, you know, grow into a player and grow, and grow into a leadership role early with a lot of kind of older experienced guys, Connacht and Garrick Sherman, I think with a big opportunity to step up. So I think it'll be a fun group to watch in this new league. What are you seeing out there? You know, the, the team has a lot of talent. Like, uh, I, you know, I, I look, they're big, they're athletic, uh, you know, a lot of great shooters and, and scores, and uh, I think they're going to have a pretty good year. I'm really looking forward to it. Well, I mean, you get to work with the team more, but this was your first yep. official Notre Dame ACC practice. What'd you see up? You there? know, it was good, Jack. Uh, again, we're trying to work up to this. I think we're starting a little early, and I just want to be careful. We went about 90 minutes, and you could tell that we've been together eight or nine times over the summer because even our younger guys have a pretty good feel of what we want to accomplish. Uh, I thought our communication was good today, and that's something I'm always going to be on them about. We've been a little bit of a quiet group at times, and we're going to have to stay after them about communicating. But our veteran guys set a great tone, and Eric Atkins basically could have run practice today. When you have a senior point guard, it's quite a luxury when you're a coach. One more. One, two, three. One, One more. more.